We are now sitting on the Sjösamis tun, the Sami settlement, and I have a man on front of me. Can you say a little bit what your name are or and why you are here in the Sjösamis tun today? Yeah, my name is Gunther Ingversen. I come from Germany and I live close on the Danish border and uh, I used to be a farmer and the farm does my son running and uh, he has a vacation uh, he has some ponies and then the children come from the cities and they make uh, on the island we have a place on the island too and they make a real nice vacation we see her at a tysk filmteam kom tidigare idag för att filma Günther och hans resa hit upp till Sjösamisk tun i första omgång. And uh, why I'm here because uh, my wife she comes from Oslo but she's a little bit sick. She can go that uh, this way not even with a tractor is a little bit crazy. I know that and uh, I wanted to uh, in the, to meet people from Norway, from Denmark, and we had a really good time. So um, they are helpful, and uh, we just discuss uh, uh, many things. So um, we have a good time. But the weather was not so good. We had much rain. It was cold, and I hope uh, it will no little be a little bit better. So um, today is good. Today is very good, and the German uh, TV uh, people came today from Hamburg. They were in Alta. Oh, how shall we them your synopsis with Winter? Och vi ska höra lite av det han säger. And uh, they had a hotel and they got here this morning. And now we have to find the other guy. He uh, got lost. So, and then we will go up to the North Cap. Yes. And when you start from Germany with the tractor? Uh, we start, uh, I start the 7th of May. And the other guy, the 2nd of May, he lives 500 kilometers uh, south from me, from my house. I was and I had had me and then I had me abgemacht and soll immer an der Straße stehen bleiben. Then is aber abgewichen and so. Som vi ser så var det runt omkring på Sjösamis tun och nere vid båten och nere vid fjärrestegnen så att si. Vi ser att vi gör upptak där nere och förbereder olika upptak som möjligen ska brukas till den tv-programmet som vi är på gott och väl en halvtimme eller något sånt. Vi märker att det blåser lite, vi har också varit med den här lilla gammen och gjort sina upptag. Men hur mycket av detta blir brukt till själva filmen, det är inte gott att se som vi kan se på tysk tv senare i juli. Men vi ska dra tillbaka till Günther och höra vad han har mer att fortälla från den här resan. Are you many men with tractors in this traveling? No, uh, there are not so many. Three German tractors, I met them. They came up here, but uh, they uh, had bigger tractors. And uh, our tractors, they are built 58, is my tractor, and only has 17 horsepower. And the other guy's uh, tractor only has 14 uh, horsepowers and one cylinder. 
and uh, we ran the highest 18 kilometer an hour. And how old are you? <laughs> I am 70, 77 years yes. old. And uh, uh, when you went home, and uh, long time they will take before you are home again. Før vi klar Günther svare på det, så skal vi se lidt bilder fra disse filmfolka, som beveger sig på det hit og dit for at gøre sine optag. De var også oppe ved Storgammen, og da fik jeg også være med. Så det bliver spændende at se, når dette er færdig produceret. Nu skal den blive flere dage her i Finnmark, før de drar tilbage til Tyskland og gjør optag, kanskje blant annet fra Nordkap og ellers rundt omkring, og med denne andre karen av disse to gamle mennene som er ute og reiser med traktor. Men la oss høre hva Gunther forteller. Yeah, the, the, we we be home. Uh, I think middle of August or maybe the end of August. We are going uh, back through Sweden, and I guess uh, I don't know, not sure if we go from Oslo to Denmark or for, from uh, Göteborg to Denmark. Mm. It's very difficult to drive in the big cities. I think we are driving in the big cities uh, during the night, so the traffic is not uh, so heavy anymore. Her ser vi de gjør nå en enkelt opptak til taljer og sånn som de vil ta med seg og klippe inn i den endelige filmen. Vi har vært rundt omkring og blitt filmet i og så var med oppe i Storgammen. Men vi skal nå gå tilbake til den siste delen av samtalen med Günther etter en lang dag med filming. Ja, because you must up for the other cars and something like that when you're driving on the... Yeah, when, uh, when there are too many cars behind us, then I uh, see that I get on the side uh, and uh, let him pass by. So uh, uh, we don't actually, here's not much traffic. We have a lot more traffic in Germany and uh, uh, here, here's it okay. I, they don't uh, have no, no uh, uh, four or five, sometimes 10 cars are behind us and then we, or some trucks and then we go on the side and then we let them go. Nobody has uh, show us uh, that we are here crazy or so. Uh, they all wave and they look <laughs> at the, the dumps and uh, they put them up and uh, they make many, many um, photos uh, and film. And um, well, they, they went from Christian Sand to the North Cap uh, all, all um, happy, most of them all happy with us. I know you have been for many days here in Sjøsamis tun in Smørfjord. And can you tell about that? What have you seen? <laughs> Før Gunther forteller om det, så la oss se litt på hva filmfolka driver med, sånn rent avslutningsvis av denne filmingen her på Sjøsamis tun, så vi da bare filmen gå. What I see here, well, I see here those uh, old huts. The the uh, people when uh, when um, the war was here and um, uh, Hitler burns uh, the their houses off or the soldiers and uh, then the people they go to the mountains into the mountains and uh, build them uh, some some this this huts. What I saw here and um, I was. Uh, kind of boring. I had to wait a little week here and um, uh, I asked uh, if I could work here. And uh, then, uh, yeah, you, you gave me the work here and uh, I fixed with the, the, with the salts uh, and with the grass and I put them up and I straightened it out here a little bit. And I get a good along with the people here. It's very good. 
så yes. Här ser vi lite av det arbete som Günther har gjort mens han har varit och bott här på Sjösamens tun. Jobbet till att lägga torr på gammarna som är nog nedstytt och tvingar för ny in. Then you like to went to the other side into fishing also. Yeah. <laughs> Have uh, you get some fish? Well, I tried to fish, but uh, I was not lucky to, to get one. But uh, maybe we go with a boat uh, today or tomorrow. Uh, and um, then I will see if we get something. There's a fisherman, he, he has more experience uh, than I don't have much experience. Yes. Well, then I... You must have a good time. Thank you. Yes. Valerius. <laughs> Thank to you, Germany. Valerius. Uh, you're very kind. Då är det tid för filmteamet att packa samman allt samman och på lata sted och dra ut till den andra karn som är ett sted där utöver på vägen mot Nordkap. Men då får vi se vad det blir av detta om det tar sig visas på tv ettervärt så är det bara tacka för mig för denna gången. Mm.